As you can probably guess with this giant table of machines in front of me, this week we are doing This or That Thursday on the Foff Creative Icon and the Foff Creative Icon 2. I'm Megan with Rocky Mountain Sewing and Vacuum and both of these machines are some of my favorites. They are incredible. These are going to be Foff's top of the line machines. The Foff Creative Icon is actually going out of the lineup as it is being replaced with the Creative Icon 2. And they both have some fabulous features. Of course, the Creative Icon 2 has even more, and it's gonna be absolutely great. So, a couple of sim similarities these machines have is, as you can tell, they're both pretty large machines. And they both do have a nice big large embroidery area as well, and a good chunk of space right here between the throat and the needle plate. They also have really good lighting here as well. And of course, as per Foff's favorite, they definitely have the integrated dual feed technology built into both of the machines as well. They also have the active stitch technology, which is like a tension metering system, which meters your thread in the fabric so that you get perfect tension every single time. But those are just the surface level features on these machines. On these machines, they both do both sewing and embroidery. You can tell there's a couple aesthetic things that are different. So, of course, this one is kind of like a navy blue purple, whereas my Foff Creative Icon 2 is going to be the Northern Lights limited edition one. They came out with three limited edition colors. In the stores, you will see the purple Aurora, which is going to be their standard color, which is a prettier, pinkier purple, which is really cool. So, you will notice the embroidery arm is like a silver color versus the white color on the old Creative Icon 1. And what, from what I can see back here, there's a nice big Foff logo in the back, and they kind of made the back side a little prettier too. Um, other than that though, let's talk about goodies that come with the machines. They're gonna come with the same basic presser feet, so they both include your quarter inch foot, your embroidery foot, all the standards that we normally see. However, the hoops are a little bit different. They both come with the three hoops that we've seen before, so the Foff 120 by 120, the Foff 260 by 200, and this is the largest with the Creative Icon 1, the 360 by 260. However, on the Creative Icon 2, it comes with the Foff Grand Dream Hoop, which this one is about 350 by 360 millimeters. So this one is an optional accessory for the Creative Icon 1 and multiple of their machines as well, but it is awesome that the Creative Icon 2 actually comes with this big hoop. They both do also have um, accessibility with the MySonet. MySonet is a really cool thing where you can put your embroidery designs online and send them straight to the machine, which is awesome. They have a whole library and a whole software program to go alongside of it. But there are a couple extra features that they've added with the MySonet, which is really cool. One of which is going to be my favorite app, at least when I was on my Creative Icon 1, I'd use it all the time, and now I use it even more with the Creative Icon 2. It's called Sew so Notice. And on that app, it actually tells you when the th machine is ready for a new thread, if the bobbin ran out, if a thread broke, it'll actually tell you. But they've added an extra piece to that. So on your Foff Creative Icon 2, there's actually a placement section as well, where you can now take a picture of your hoop and send it to the machine so you can get everything exactly placed where you want it to be. Alongside of that, the new Foff Creative Icon 2 has a projector. And the projector is really awesome for placement as well, because you can see exactly where your design is gonna go on your fabric and adjust it where you need to. And that way, you know when you're ready to stitch out, it's gonna be perfect, which is awesome. And with that note, we're going to switch over to the sewing side of the machine. The sewing side of the machine, they both have the Foff exclusive decorative stitches, which of course are amazing. They've got the floating stitches, the ribbon stitches, the stacking stitches, all of the stitches, which is really fun. However, they have added, of course, more features on the Creative Icon 2, one of which is artificial, tech or artificial intelligence. So one thing that is so neat on this machine is on the Creative Icon 2, if you put your quarter inch foot, I can't tell you how many times I put my quarter inch foot on my Creative Icon and accidentally switched to a zigzag and started stitching. It's not fun when you break those needles. <laughs> On the Creative Icon 2, they have artificial intelligence in there, so it actually senses what presser foot is on your machine. So if you choose to do a zigzag and you still have that quarter inch foot on there, she'll go, no, 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 you can't do that, stop, don't do that. 
And I think that is amazing. It'll also tell you if you installed your foot on the machine incorrectly. And of course, you also have the projector for the sewing side on the Creative Icon 2 as well. On the Creative Icon 1, we have a lot of theme guides that are options and things like that. But on the Creative Icon 2, that um, projector also acts as a seam guide. It has a grid. You can change the colors. It's absolutely incredible. Uh, and to go even further, if you know MySonet, there's also projects on the MySonet blog, which you can pull up on your machine. But what is cool is that you can tell the Creative Icon 2 to kind of put it away for later and bring it back out. It is awesome and it is seamless. They've definitely increased the usability of the blog on the machine on the Creative Icon 2 because you can actually search for specific projects and things on that one. Whereas this one, you're just scrolling and scrolling and scrolling. So you can still see the projects. You just have to kind of hunt for them a little bit. The last thing that I really am excited for on the Creative Icon 2 that the Icon 1 unfortunately does not have is going to be the ability to have smart technology. So on the Creative Icon 2, you can hook it up to your Alexa and go, hey Alexa, why did my embroidery design pucker? And she will tell you. You can tell her, hey Alexa, stop embroidering if you need to go away for a little bit. It is going to be awesome. So both the FOF Creative Icon and the Creative Icon 2 are powerhouses of machines. They will do so much. They've got great piercing power. They've got the integrated dual feed technology. They have tons of usability and embroidery as well, but the Creative Icon 2 has even more. So definitely come check out both of these machines in our stores at Rocky Mountain Sewing and Vacuum. We only have a limited number of Creative Icons left. And although we love the machine, we can't wait to see more people playing with and enjoying their Creative Icon 2s. And of course the Creative Icon as well. Thank you so much for joining me for this, this or that Thursday. We will see you next week and we'll see you in the stores. <laughs>